Hello, hello guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I am Ashley, and this is Pour Your Art Out. Um, I have just created this channel because, um, I don't know, I just felt like there were a bunch of different videos that I wanted to put out that my other channels just kind of didn't, um, I don't know, it didn't really work as well on them, and so I wanted a different channel to put it all on. So, I wanted to show you guys, these are the two journals that I have left in my Etsy shop. So, I have been dwindling down, um, and now I only have two left. And so, these are the journals. Now, you can have a custom-made journal. I do custom requests. Um, all you have to do is email me. I will leave my email in the description box below, or you can comment on this video, and we can talk about it. Um, but I do have that option. I also um, did do a flip through of each of these, and this flip through was on my other channel. Um, it was on Creative Chaos. So if you guys want to see the flip through of this journal, I'm going to link it in the description box below. Um, and you can go over there and watch that flip through if you haven't seen it already. But this one right here is more of a galaxy um, night in the woods type of journal. Um, I really, really love it. It's the widest journal that I've ever made. So this is like, if you look at my hand, this is like my, my usual journal. It's about six and a half inches wide. This one is much, much bigger. I forget exactly how much the width is, but it's, why am I doing it that way? It is nine and a half inches wide. So it's, it's a big girl and I really like the width of it. So you guys saw on this channel, the last video I did, I did a flip through of this really grungy journal. It is available in my Etsy shop. It does have a tie that goes with it, and it also has a tassel that goes with it as well. And then it is this Galaxy Night Foresty journal that is really, really large, and she has a tassel with her as well. Um, her tassel is fluffy and nice, and she also has a tied fabric to her as well. I really, really love this. I think that it's so fun and pretty and... It just encompasses all things night sky and galaxy, moon, and all of the things. It has charms that dangle down from the spine. And I just love this. I love the fabric that hangs off of it. I just really love it. And it's huge. And I like the options that it gives for a lot of different writing space and um, pockets and things like that. Just because it is on the larger side. And I really enjoy it. I just think it's beautiful. And I really enjoyed making it as well. So I'm going to leave the... Um, I really like that envelope. I'm, I'm going to leave the um, flip through down below. So that you guys can kind of go back and look at that. I'm just kind of revisiting all of this. Because I, I haven't flipped through it in a really long time. Probably since the day that I filmed that video. <laughs> and it's just fun to look back on it and be like, oh, this is so pretty. Like... I remember making this now and you know it's just fun but um but yeah I'm gonna link that below so that you can go and see that flip through if you wish and I'll also link my Etsy shop in the description as well so that you can see that video but I just love this journal I think she's a lot of fun and um yeah so I have that one left and then the one that I just created um as well and those are the only two I have left right now. So I'm working on restocking. I um, I had um, a mishap with my sewing machine. And I have asked every sewing machine guru and um, expert that I can possibly ask. And I cannot figure out for the life of me what is wrong with it. I have tried every trick. I have cleaned it. I have oiled it. I have taken it apart. I have worked on the tension. I have worked to make sure that the timing is correct. I have fixed the spool, changed the thread, changed the bobbin, changed the bobbin case, um, re-threaded, changed the needle. Um, I have done everything that you can possibly do to this stupid sewing machine except what's wrong with it and it still won't work and so I um I have a replacement that is not new but it will be new to me um and um I'm going to pick it up tomorrow so I'm really excited for that because I have lots of things to make and I don't have a sewing machine and I don't know what just fell off but I'm gonna have to find that I think it was I don't know what that was something a charm of some kind that was 
that fell off, but I will find that. But anyways, I just wanted to share this with you and show you which ones I have left so that you would know. I will link this flip through down in the description box below so that you can go over there and check it out if you wish. And um, I will link my Etsy shop as well. Um, so definitely go check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.